What I well, ironically, uh, when I moved into broadcasting, my first collegiate game was uh, Louisville, South Florida, here at Louisville. Okay. So uh, I've been here. I've been on Floyd Street. Extremely impressed with uh, the facilities and. I was just telling Ken, who's done a wonderful job in college soccer, you know, he was at Akron, then came here, he's really made two programs legit. He's taking care of the American player, which is special for me, but now he's moving into the ACC, which is men's soccer, it's, it's the best league, hands down. Now he's got a new stadium coming in, I mean, he's going to be making some noise, it, the recruiting's going to step up, this program is going to be, if it isn't already top five in the country, it will be top five before you know it. Austin Berry and Nick DeLeon, some MLS guys. Andrew up there. Farrell's Andrew another Farrell. one. Yeah. Yep. What, uh, what does it say about Louisville that they're producing that kind of talent? Well, they're producing talent. You know, you can produce talent, but then you got to produce talent that's ready to play right away. And you just said two guys that last year were in the rookie of the year consideration. Austin Berry ended up winning it, but Nick DeLeon and Austin Berry, great players. And then this year, Andrew Farrell in, in New England is also going to be in the Rookie of the Year consideration at the end of the year. He's producing players, this program's producing players that are ready to play right away. That's the difference between other programs because like a University of Maryland, you got to produce quality players, but you got to produce them that can play right away, and Ken's doing that. Louisville went to Red Bull Stadium and, and Sporting KC to get ideas for their own stadium. <laughs> those are pretty good ideas, by the way. Yeah, yeah. What, what, do, you, what do you like about those stadiums, and, and what does that mean for Louisville? You're asking a guy that was uh, playing in the Meadowlands when he had to go play in New York, and now I go call games for the New York Red Bulls. It is night and day. Um, Sporting KC is arguably the best stadium in our league, and that is for a franchise where nobody wanted to go play for the Kansas City Wizards at the time because they were like the ugly stepchild of the Kansas City Chiefs. If this stadium here is anything like that, then Louisville may have the best soccer stadium in the country in college soccer. Louisville still a year away from moving into that ACC. What can you tell us about ACC soccer and what Louisville should expect that year? I don't think I'm standing here if I didn't choose to go to University of Maryland and play in ACC. And I, and I think the ACC, because of game in and game out in the congestion of quality teams and quality programs on the East Coast. So your weekend games are the ACC conference games, but your midweek games playing Georgetown. You know, it's, it's playing William & Mary, schools that are consistently in the tournament. And I think Louisville will have a, a rude awakening a little bit coming into the ACC kind of schedule, depending on what their non-ACC schedule is. But if anyone can make the quick adjustment, that's Ken.